Hello guys, welcome back to Sports Corner GH. My name is Adam. So guys, quickly, let's jump into it. And I want to begin from the camp of Countryman Zogo. He has apologized to Black Star's second assistant coach called John Pencil. Now we all know John Pencil sued Countryman Zogo and also three other sports journalists in Ghana here. Let's check out Countryman Zogo's apology to John Pencil. Watch this video. Well, we are the NASA who, who know who are not. Why are they? Well, what kind of feelings in the one? No, no, but can I believe they are mad and I can't say they are to be trapped because you don't put your coupon the worker or say it's straightforward. You know, so what you are nine, you need a nice one. Why they have a job a simple zone woman with us in team. I mean, my job painting up apology, say my and no, maybe I'm trying to know a blaster's legend. One is not coming in, me, sir, honestly speaking. What they say, a former deputy, I say, say, a deputy blasters, uh, coach, I don't paint me boy. Ah, the no me beer, me ketiana, I'm kuyi. Me who say, uh, a hano, what they say, a hano pa, but a before bar, a day, and send me bar, wa um, who say, what, 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 me catch and say, me very sorry. Say, you know, that time me buffoons are no. Me ma, a buffoon no call baby any kind say anything. Echo to on fan channel here, pa. Na football ni di no ani ni ni wum. They say me off Antonio say echo to former blasters goalkeeper Barcelona ninety two. Um, what they say? Ghana for J bronze. Oh, oh, see, we go there be one ni ni. So guys, let's just cut this video short and I think you, you get the idea of where this video is going. So that's country was Zongo apologizing to John Pencil. He says that see, anger makes him say a lot of things. So he apologizes. And let's not forget, he has been sued with, you know, three other journalists and also where they work. So the likes of Angel Broadcasting Network and the likes, they have all been sued by John Pencil and he's demanding over 18 million Ghana cities and I mean that's huge but then that's the apology me all I can say is that Charlie to as human we should we should all forgive countryman Zongo yeah in even though the insults are not like and yet necessary I mean it's all for professional but then I mean he's has helping already and he's apologizing that it's due to the anger and everything so this is my own two things John Pence should forgive and also forget Currently, she's the assistant coach of the Black Stars. We wish him all the best. They should do well and bring Black Stars to uh, to to its 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 original form. Let's start winning games. Let's start qualifying for tournaments. Let's do that. So, guys, moving away from that, so let's talk about Asamoah and the Baby Jet. Today, he launched the all regional games at the La Palm Royal Hotel, where a lot of you know journalists, news agencies, they were all there to cover that, and he has spoken about it a lot. He has done a lot of media rounds about the all regional games now. Let's listen to what Asamoah had to say during the press lunch. Check out this video. So, tell a friend to tell another friend to tell another friend that all regional games is here. From a week to tour all the system regions to create awareness that we are coming. We are not coming here to sleep, coming to work to make the other generation benefit. So, 
again, all the corporate organizations who want to come, make sure you come up. Let's sponsor this event to make Ghana the great one. Thank you so much for coming. Thank you everybody to the media. So guys, we just heard from Asamoajan talking about the original games and all I have to say is that we need to support Asamoajan. I think this is very good because during the African games, especially with the volleyball, the female volleyball team with Ghana, I mean, and when I looked at it, I was like, no, this is not our best. I mean, I believe that there are people who can really, really be involved in other disciplines. The original games is not only about football, so... During the press lunch, there was Bukong Baku there, so definitely it involved other sports. So boxing, volleyball, athletics, everything inclusive. That is why it is an all-regional game. So football, volleyball, everything inclusive. And I think this is a great initiative. If this is something that should have been done by the government, but then as a modern has taken it upon himself to do, and I think it's very good. It will let us know the best of the best from every region so that when you are waiting for games like this whether the olympics whether the african games we can send in our best of best for every single discipline and this is what i want because when you look at olympics you see ghana like two or three in maybe some few disciplines that's all but we need them in almost every discipline whether it's an african game or olympics swimming or football or athletics volleyball table tennis whatever it is we need our people in the and Asamojan is doing great with this. So, guys, let's all support the all regional games now. So, guys, finally, let's talk about Joseph Pinto. Now, Joseph Pinto has been a victim of a social media racist abuse, and we are going to talk about that now. Joseph Pinto plays for LA Galaxy, and they played a football match against Los Angeles FC, which is LAFC, in the MLS. And then a racial abuse happened on social media. And the club, that's LA Galaxy, has come out with a statement. And we are going to read the statement very, very quickly. Now, the statement says that LA Galaxy forward Joseph Pinto was the victim of a racist social media incident following Saturday's football match against LAFC. The club stands with Joseph and anyone who has suffered racist abuse through social media and any elsewhere. The incident was immediately reported to the Major League Soccer. We are working with MLS to ensure Joseph has all the resources and support that he needs at this time. There is no place for racism in our community, in our league, or anywhere elsewhere in our society. And this is the statement released by LA Galaxy. You know, following up on the, the racist abuse on Joseph Pinto, I mean, I think it's unwarranted. It's unnecessary. I mean, today's day and age, we are in the 21st century, and still, there's racism in football every single time. They are kneeling down again, no racism, no racism, but still it's in there. And it's sad to see that it's a it's a black star player that is going through this in the MLS. A racist, you know, their comments on social media. I mean, it's happening in football. I mean, it's high time this thing is, you know, people have been punished severely for this. That would go using the send a message to others. But then, guys, this is what happened to Joseph Pinto and the statement from LA Galaxy. Let me know your thoughts about it. Let me know your thoughts about the original games by Asam Wajan and also Kachu Manzoro's apology to John Pinto. So, guys, this is why I end today's video. Don't forget to like and then subscribe. I'll make sure to see you in the next one. Charlie, we go by.